Hi, hi, hi! Welcome back to the Kooby Kids Fun Time Learning Adventure with me, Kooby! Today, we are going to be exploring the world of sound toys. I've traveled across the wide world and brought back an amazing collection of musical instruments. Now, we hear sound using our ears, so pay attention to your ears as we listen to the different sounds that these amazing musical instruments can make. Fun, fun, fun. First up is a little rattle. It's got rice or beans or something inside that makes a rattle sound when you shake it. You probably have one of these. They can be great fun. Here's another rattle. My sister made this for my son. It's, isn't it cute? It's a little rattle bear. Fun, fun, fun. Whoa, look at this thing. This is kind of a rattle, but it's got a net of shells around it. I wonder what this sounds like. This thing you can play in a bunch of different ways. <laughs> wow, cool. This is from Africa. That's another continent in the world where they make amazing music. Oh, what else do we have in here? Maracas. These are kind of like the rattle, but they have handles on them. Fun, fun, fun. These ones say Cuba on them. That's an island where they make incredible music. And that's where these maracas came from. The island of Cuba. What else do we have? Oh. Ooh, this is like two rattles connected by a string. It's called a kashaka. And it also comes from the continent of Africa. You hold it like this and you go. It has the shake sound, but also a clack sound when the two balls hit each other together. Mmm. Woo. Now this is a wind instrument. It's a pan pipe. It's got all these different tubes and you can blow across the top to make sound. Let's try it out. This one's kind of hard to play. Mm. Here's another wind instrument. It's a bamboo flute. This one is from Indonesia, an island in Asia. It's got these finger holes to put your fingers on top and a mouth hole that you blow into. You blow into the mouth hole and then you raise your fingers to make different sounds from the flute. Let's try it out. Cool. I love this flute. 
Some flutes are easier to play than others. This one is really easy to play. That's why I love it. Mmm. Another kind of wind instrument is this recorder. Now this one is made out of plastic, but it's got the same finger holes and a different kind of mouth hole, but the same idea. You blow into it while you cover the holes to make different sounds. What does this one sound like? It's kind of high pitched sound. I don't like it as, as much as the bamboo flute. Mmm. Look at this thing. It looks like a microphone, but it's not plugged in. It just has this little thing on the bottom. Hello. Hi, hi, hi. Fun, fun, fun. Oh. That's a cool sound toy. It came from Disneyland in America. What else do we have in here? Oh, it's spoons, a pair of spoons. You know spoons like when you're eating food, but you can also make music with spoons. This is like two spoons that are connected together at their backs with a handle and you can go like, Fun, fun, fun! Who knew that spoons are a musical instrument? Now we do! What's next? Hmm. These two pieces of wood. Bang them together and they make a really nice clack sound. Now, a trick with these things is that the way you hold them affects what kind of sound it makes. If you just hold it tight, it makes kind of a duller sound. Whereas, if you open up your hand and make a pocket of air, it sounds different. It's got more air to it. Fun, fun, fun. Mmm. This is a tambourine. It's like a circle with these little metal bits that jangle. And you can also hit it, kind of like a drum. Or you can shake it. If you like banging stuff, Having a nice tambourine is a great thing to have. So many different musical instruments. And there's more too. Whoa. This thing's got a strap that I can put around my neck so I can't drop it and little straps for my hands to go into. This is called an accordion. Most accordions are really big, but this is a small one for smaller hands. And it's got this latch here that you need to open up to get it working. we we'll just pull up. Oh! Oh wait. There's another latch on the bottom too. Let's get that one open. The accordion is a fun instrument that you play by squeezing these two boxes together and pulling them apart.
It's also got these buttons on here that make it sound different. Now, this accordion, it seems to be missing a button on this side. It's a little bit broken. Accordions sometimes break. That's why you gotta treat them with really a lot of care. And make sure to put the snaps back on when you're done and treat it gently. Don't bang this one around or it might break even more. Even so, it was a lot of fun. Mmm. What's this thing? What a wild musical instrument. This is called a thunder stick. Or this is called a thunder tube. It's got a tube, kind of like a drum. And then this metal spring thing on the bottom that makes this thunderous sound. That one's loud. A little bit scary, too. That's okay. It's just musical instruments. Let's move on. Hmm. This is a slide whistle. It's kind of like the recorder or the flute, but there's no holes for your fingers. Instead, there's this slide bet. Let me play it for you. Fun, fun, fun. What a cool musical instrument. A slide whistle. Mmm. This is another kind of wind instrument. Wind instruments are called wind instruments because you play them with your, the breath from your mouth. Like you're blowing wind into the instrument. This one's shaped differently than the flute, but it also has these little holes for your fingers to cover and a mouth hole for you to blow into. Fun, fun, fun! I think this one is from South America, a continent down south. They have all kinds of incredible music in South America. That's where this pan pipe came from as well, South America. Oh, I think these ones come from South America too. These are called clackers or castanets. Let me see. Little thing for my finger. And then they clack together. I've got two of them, one for each hand. Let me play these castanets while I dance. Fun, fun, fun. What else do we have in here? Hmm. Ah, 
Now I would call this a, a shaker or a rattle, but it's got a handle too. This one came from Mexico and it uses these dried bead shell type things to make fun sounds when you shake them and they clack together. Fun, fun, fun. What else is in here? Oh, it's a kazoo. Maybe you've played one of these before. It's a little bit like a flute, but way easier. There's no finger stuff involved. You just put it in your mouth and then you hum or you can even talk and it makes fun sounds. Let me show you. Hello, hun, hun, hun. This is a cool <laughs> that was a little silly, but fun, fun, fun. Mm. This is another musical instrument. It's kind of like a shaker, but it's got these metal things. Mm. Oh, we've got a little case here. It says the Blues King on it. It's a blue case. I wonder what's inside. Oh yeah, it's a harmonica. This is another wind instrument that you play with your mouth. It's got all these different holes and each hole that you blow in makes a different sound. Hmm, it's got these numbers on it here so I can tell which way is up and which way is down. I put the numbers up. Harmonica is a great musical instrument that's very portable. You can take it with you to the beach or the park or the playground. It fits right in a pocket. And it makes certain sounds by blowing out and other sounds by sucking air in. This is really very versatile. Fun, fun, fun. I love the harmonica. Mmm. Jingle bells, like from that song, Jingle Bells. These ones have a strap that you can put around an arm or a leg, and then you'd get jingle bells everywhere you went. Well, the last musical toy that we have for today are these Tibetan chimes. It's two pieces of metal connected by a leather strap. And when you hit the two pieces together, it makes a beautiful chime sound. Fun, fun, fun. Well, that's the tour of my musical toy box. What an awesome variety of different musical toys and instruments we got to hear today. I hope that you enjoyed hearing with your ears all the different sounds. I wonder if there's anything else I'm forgetting. <gasps> A treasure chest back there. I wonder what's inside. What's in the treasure chest? 
What could it be? What's in the treasure chest? Fun for you, fun for me! What's in the treasure chest? What could it be? What's in the treasure chest? Let's open it up and see! Let's open it up and see! This treasure chest has a latch here. Push up from the bottom and flick down that part from the top. I wonder what's inside. <gasps> it's earmuffs. Now these are ear protection. They go on your head and around your ears and they make everything really quiet. If you're in a situation where it's too noisy and you don't want all of the sound, you can put on ear protection and it won't be as loud. These are great to have, especially if you like going to loud parties, but you don't want your ears to get hurt from all the loud sounds. Earmuffs, fun, fun, fun. Well, thanks so much for joining me. Let's take a minute and give thanks. Let's give thanks. I'm so thankful that I have ears, that I can hear all kinds of fun and cool and different sounds from. And I'm grateful for all the people of the world and their different musical traditions and sounds that we get to explore and experience. And I'm grateful for my mom for instilling in me a love of music from an early age. And I'm grateful for you for joining me in this amazing adventure in music and sound and living. Thank you. If you've had a good time, please subscribe to the Kubi Kids Fun Time Learning Channel. Click that red subscribe button and don't miss any of our awesome adventures coming up with me, Kubi. Bye, bye, bye. Kubi kids, Kubi learning, Kubi fun, fun, fun.